Da Sin Meem. These are verses of the clear book. We recite to you from the news of Moses and Pharaoh in truth for a people who believe. Indeed, Pharaoh exalted himself in the land and made its people into factions, oppressing a sector among them, slaughtering their newborn sons and keeping their females alive. Indeed, he was of the corruptors. And we wanted to confer favor upon those who were oppressed in the land and make them leaders and make them inheritors, and establish them in the land and show Pharaoh and his minister Haman and their soldiers through them that which they had feared. And we inspired to the mother of Moses, suckle him, but when you fear for him, cast him into the river and do not fear and do not grieve. Indeed, we will return him to you and will make him one of the messengers. And the family of Pharaoh picked him up out of the river so that he would become to them an enemy and a cause of grief. Indeed, Pharaoh and Haman and their soldiers were deliberate sinners. And the wife of Pharaoh said, He will be a comfort of the eye for me and for you. Do not kill him. Perhaps he may benefit us, or we may adopt him as a son. And they perceived not. And the heart of Moses' mother became empty of all else. She was about to disclose the matter concerning him had we not bound fast her heart that she would be of the believers. And she said to his sister, Follow him. So she watched him from a distance while they perceived not. And we had prevented from him all wet nurses before. So she said, Shall I direct you to a household that will be responsible for him for you, while they are to him for his upbringing sincere? So we restored him to his mother, that she might be content and not grieve, and that she would know that the promise of Allah is true. But most of the people do not know. And when he attained his full strength and was mentally mature, we bestowed upon him judgment and knowledge, and thus do we reward the doers of good. And he entered the city at a time of inattention by its people, and found therein two men fighting, one from his faction and one from among his enemy. And the one from his faction called for help to him against the one from his enemy. So Moses struck him and unintentionally killed him. Moses said, This is from the work of Satan. Indeed, he is a manifest, misleading enemy. He said, My Lord, indeed I have wronged myself, so forgive me. And he forgave him. Indeed, he is the forgiving, the merciful. He said, My Lord, for the favor you bestowed upon me, I will never be an assistant to the criminals. And he became inside the city fearful and anticipating exposure when suddenly the one who sought his help the previous day cried out to him once again. Moses said to him, Indeed, you are an evident, persistent deviator. And when he wanted to strike the one who was an enemy to both of them, he said, O Moses, do you intend to kill me as you killed someone yesterday? You only want to be a tyrant in the land and do not want to be of the amenders. And a man came from the farthest end of the city, running. He said, O Moses, indeed the eminent ones are conferring over you, intending to kill you, so leave the city. Indeed, I am to you of the sincere advisers. So he left it, fearful and anticipating apprehension. He said, My Lord, save me from the wrongdoing people. And when he directed himself toward Madian, he said, Perhaps my Lord will guide me to the sound way. And when he came to the well of Madian, he found there a crowd of people watering their flocks, and he found aside from them two women driving back their flocks. He said, What is your circumstance? They said, 
We do not water until the shepherds dispatch their flocks, and our father is an old man. So he watered their flocks for them. Then he went back to the shade and said, My Lord, indeed I am, for whatever good you would send down to me in need. Then one of the two women came to him walking with shyness. She said, Indeed, my father invites you that he may reward you for having watered for us. So when he came to him and related to him the story, he said, Fear not, you have escaped from the wrongdoing people. One of the women said, O my father, hire him. Indeed, the best one you can hire is the strong and the trustworthy. He said, Indeed, I wish to wed you one of these, my two daughters, on the condition that you serve me for eight years. But if you complete ten, it will be as a favor from you. And I do not wish to put you in difficulty. You will find me, if Allah wills, from among the righteous. Moses said, That is established between me and you. Whichever of the two terms I complete, there is no injustice to me. And Allah, over what we say, is witness. And when Moses had completed the term and was traveling with his family, he perceived from the direction of the mount a fire. He said to his family, Stay here. Indeed, I have perceived a fire. Perhaps I will bring you from there some information or burning wood from the fire that you may warm yourselves. But when he came to it, he was called from the right side of the valley in a blessed spot, from the tree, O Moses, indeed I am Allah, Lord of the worlds. And he was told, Throw down your staff. But when he saw it writhing as if it was a snake, he turned in flight and did not return. Allah said, O Moses, approach and fear not. Indeed, you are of the secure. Insert your hand into the opening of your garment. It will come out white without disease. And draw in your arm close to you as prevention from fear. For those are two proofs from your Lord to Pharaoh and his establishment. Indeed, they have been a people defiantly disobedient. He said, My Lord, indeed I killed from among them someone, and I fear they will kill me. My brother Aaron is more fluent than me in tongue, so send him with me as support, verifying me. Indeed, I fear that they will deny me. Allah said, We will strengthen your arm through your brother, and grant you both supremacy so they will not reach you. It will be through our signs. You and those who follow you will be the predominant. But when Moses came to them with our signs as clear evidences, they said, This is not except invented magic, and we have not heard of this religion among our forefathers. And Moses said, My Lord is more knowing than we or you of who has come with guidance from him, and to whom will be succession in the home. Indeed, wrongdoers do not succeed. And Pharaoh said, O eminent ones, I have not known you to have a god other than me. Then ignite for me, O Haman, a fire upon the clay, and make for me a tower that I may look at the god of Moses. And indeed, I do think he is among the liars. And he was arrogant, he and his soldiers, in the land, without right. And they thought that they would not be returned to us. So we took him and his soldiers and threw them into the sea. So see how was the end of the wrongdoers. And we made them leaders inviting to the fire, and on the day of resurrection they will not be helped. And caused to overtake them in this world a curse, and on the day of resurrection they will be of the despised. We gave Moses the scripture, after we had destroyed the former generations, as enlightenment for the people and guidance and mercy that they might be reminded. And you, O Muhammad, were not on the western side of the mount when we revealed to Moses the command, and you were not among the witnesses to that. But we produced many generations after Moses, 
and prolonged was their duration. And you were not a resident among the people of Madian, reciting to them our verses, but we were senders of this message. And you were not at the side of the mount when we called Moses, but were sent as a mercy from your Lord to warn a people to whom no warner had come before you, that they might be reminded. And if not that a disaster should strike them for what their hands put forth of sins, and they would say, Our Lord, why did you not send us a messenger, so we could have followed your verses and been among the believers? But when the truth came to them from us, they said, Why was he not given like that which was given to Moses? Did they not disbelieve in that which was given to Moses before? They said, They are but two works of magic supporting each other, and indeed we are in both disbelievers. Say, Then bring a scripture from Allah which is more guiding than either of them, that I may follow it if you should be truthful. But if they do not respond to you, then know that they only follow their own desires. And who is more astray than one who follows his desire without guidance from Allah? Indeed, Allah does not guide the wrongdoing people. And we have repeatedly conveyed to them the Quran that they might be reminded. Those to whom we gave the scripture before it, they are believers in it. And when it is recited to them, they say, We have believed in it. Indeed, it is the truth from our Lord. Indeed, we were even before it, Muslims, submitting to Allah. Those will be given their reward twice for what they patiently endured, and because they avert evil through good, and from what we have provided them they spend. And when they hear ill speech, they turn away from it and say, For us are our deeds, and for you are your deeds. Peace will be upon you, we seek not the ignorant. Indeed, O Muhammad, you do not guide whom you like, but Allah guides whom he wills, and he is most knowing of the rightly guided. And they say, If we were to follow the guidance with you, we would be swept from our land. Have we not established for them a safe sanctuary, to which are brought the fruits of all things as provision from us? But most of them do not know. And how many a city have we destroyed that was insolent in its way of living? And those are their dwellings which have not been inhabited after them except briefly. And it is we who were the inheritors. Never would your Lord have destroyed the cities until he had sent to their mother a messenger reciting to them our verses. And we would not destroy the cities except while their people were wrongdoers. And whatever thing you people have been given, it is only for the enjoyment of worldly life and its adornment. And what is with Allah is better and more lasting, so will you not use reason? Then is he whom we have promised a good promise, which he will obtain, like he for whom we provided enjoyment of worldly life, but then he is, on the day of resurrection, among those presented for punishment in hell? And warn of the day he will call them and say, Where are my partners which you used to claim? Those upon whom the word will have come into effect will say, Our Lord, these are the ones we led to error. We led them to error just as we were in error. We declare our dissociation from them to you. They did not use to worship us. And it will be said, Invoke your partners, and they will invoke them but they will not respond to them, and they will see the punishment, if only they had followed guidance. And mention the day he will call them and say, What did you answer the messengers? But the information will be unapparent to them that day, so they will not be able to ask one another. But as for one who had repented, believed, and done righteousness, It is promised by Allah that he will be among the successful. And your Lord creates what he wills and chooses. Not for them was the choice. Exalted is Allah and high above what they associate with him.
and your Lord knows what their breasts conceal and what they declare. And he is Allah, there is no deity except him. To him is due all praise in the first life and the hereafter, and his is the final decision, and to him you will be returned. Say, have you considered, if Allah should make for you the night continuous until the day of resurrection, what deity other than Allah could bring you light, then will you not hear? Say, have you considered, if Allah should make for you the day continuous until the day of resurrection, what deity other than Allah could bring you a night in which you may rest, then will you not see? And out of his mercy he made for you the night and the day, that you may rest therein and by day seek from his bounty, and that perhaps you will be grateful. Warn of the day he will call them and say, Where are my partners which you used to claim? And we will extract from every nation a witness and say, Produce your proof. And they will know that the truth belongs to Allah, and lost from them is that which they used to invent. Indeed, Karun was from the people of Moses, but he tyrannized them, and we gave him of treasures whose keys would burden a band of strong men. Thereupon his people said to him, Do not exult. Indeed, Allah does not like the exultant. But seek through that which Allah has given you, the home of the hereafter, and yet do not forget your share of the world, and do good as Allah has done good to you, and desire not corruption in the land. Indeed, Allah does not like corruptors. He said, I was only given it because of knowledge I have. Did he not know that Allah had destroyed before him of generations those who were greater than him in power and greater in accumulation of wealth? But the criminals about their sins will not be asked. So he came out before his people in his adornment. Those who desired the worldly life said, Oh, would that we had like what was given to Karun. Indeed, he is one of great fortune. But those who had been given knowledge said, Woe to you! The reward of Allah is better for he who believes and does righteousness, and none are granted it except the patient. And we caused the earth to swallow him and his home, and there was for him no company to aid him other than Allah, nor was he of those who could defend themselves. And those who had wished for his position the previous day began to say, Oh, how Allah extends his provision to whom he wills of his servants and restricts it. If not that Allah had conferred favor on us, he would have caused it to swallow us. Oh, how the disbelievers do not succeed. That home of the hereafter we assign to those who do not desire exaltedness upon the earth or corruption and the best outcome is for the righteous. Whoever comes on the day of judgment with a good deed will have better than it, and whoever comes with an evil deed, then those who did evil deeds will not be recompensed except as much as what they used to do. Indeed, O Muhammad, he who imposed upon you the Quran will take you back to a place of return. Say, my Lord is most knowing of who brings guidance and who is in clear error. And you were not expecting that the book would be conveyed to you, but it is a mercy from your Lord, so do not be an assistant to the disbelievers. Never let them avert you from the verses of Allah after they have been revealed to you. And invite people to your Lord, and never be of those who associate others with Allah. And do not invoke with Allah another deity. There is no deity except him. Everything will be destroyed except his face. His is the judgment, and to him you will be returned.